Hello everyone, happy Friday. It is Connor here. I hope you guys are having a great day so far. It is time for another candle review. If you missed it from earlier, I did a review this morning on Winter Night Stars from Yankee Candle, which is a new one, a part of their Holiday 2022 collection. Then I reviewed a classic from Yankee, Balsam and Cedar, and then now I'm back for another classic review of Christmas Cookie. So Christmas Cookie has been out for as long as I have been alive, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> so um, yeah, this has just been a classic. I remember this is the candle. My mom burned candles when I was younger, but she wasn't as crazy as I am. She just had candles every once in a while. But Christmas Cookie is actually one that I remembered her burning. So this one is kind of special to me and I really love it. Um, I definitely love this scent as well. I'll talk about that in a second. But yeah, I did purchase it in the three wick. Um, three wicks are just really nice if you want a really clean burn, but then also that increased strength and throw. It burns really well and then it's also very strong. So I'm very happy with that. I do, normally my go-to is the signature jar, which I'm very, I'm very, I love that one. And that's what I reviewed this morning for the Winter Night Stars. But then for this one in the Balsam and Cedar, I reviewed them in the three wicks. But anyways, we can go ahead and get into the description and notes for this one. So the description says, buttery, rich, vanilla scented holiday sugar cookies. The top notes are creamy vanilla bean, the mid notes are nutmeg, cinnamon, sugar, and then your base notes are vanilla, butter, and baked notes. So I really do love this one. This is a delicious, delicious Christmas cookie scent. Um, I definitely get the creamy vanilla bean. I really get that baked sugar cookie. Um, of course the butter, the bakery notes, it's just, it all ties in really well together and it smells like you're walking in on your grandma in her house and you're walking in on her baking cookies and it just smells so delicious and fantastic and it does remind me a lot of Christmas. Um, so I'm really happy about that. As far as the nutmeg and the cinnamon go, I really don't get a spiciness from this one. Yankee has another one called Christmas, or sorry, Cookies with Santa or Santa's Cookies, something like that. It has the word Santa in it. That one is more of like a caramel cookie and I think it has more spiciness to it. But if you just want like a plain good old sugar cookie scent, then I would definitely go for a Christmas cookie. This is definitely the one to go with. They also have Christmas Wish, which I think I've talked about a lot on the channel. Um, and it's like a cookie and then tree scent. So it's like if you're walking in your grandma baking cookies, like I said for this one, but then in Christmas Wish, she has a real live tree and it just smells amazing. I love that one too. But Christmas Cookie is the classic and I think that this is one that most people like. Um, it's just a basic vanilla cookie scent, but it definitely invokes a lot of those holiday feelings and nostalgia and it's just a really delicious gourmand cookie scent. So I really do love the scent. And now onto the performance. So this has been performing really spectacular for me. I will go ahead and give you guys an overhead view. As you can see, I am about halfway done with this one. The burn has been amazing. No sooting at all. Um, as you can see, there's no dirtiness in the wax. It's just a really clean burn. And I'm honestly shocked because I normally don't have this good of a luck with Yankee, but they are doing it really well. If you guys know, like my Kringle 100% soy, I'm really um, always like raving about how clean they are, but this one has been just doing pretty much on par with that. Um, and then as far as the wicks go, the wicks have been doing really well for me. I do trim them um, because if you don't, then they will get sooty, but I do trim the wicks just because it controls the flame. And I pretty much always trim the wicks with Yankee. Some companies like Kringle, I don't trim the wicks really. Homeworks, I kind of sometimes do, sometimes don't. Bath and Body Works, I sometimes do, sometimes don't. Normally with Yankee, I always trim the wicks um, just because they do get out of control and will make it pretty sooty and just messy. So that is how the performance has been doing. As far as the strength and the throw has been, this has been, 
I would say pretty on par for like a typical Yankee. It was, it's about like a five to a five and a half. I've been burning it in the uh, family room and it's just kind of been a lighter one. Vanilla scents like gourmand vanillas are not always hot, like very strong and they're pretty hard to do because they just, it's a light, vanilla is a lighter scent, so it's hard to get it to throw well and for you to actually be able to smell it. Um, I would say it's kind of in the middle. It's just definitely a lighter scent, so if you're looking for like a lighter vanilla, I would definitely go for a Christmas cookie. Um, it definitely gives that lighter um, vibe to it. So yeah, that is Christmas cookie here for you. Short but sweet little review. Let me know your thoughts down below in the comments and uh, let me know what you guys think of the scent. Please give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you are new here and uh, make sure to turn on the notification bell so you can get notified every time I upload. And I will be back tomorrow for the good old Weekend Fragrance Roundup. See you guys then. Bye.